welcome to data pandit so today we are going to talk about key change function uh, you know so uh, let's take one uh, scenario and try to solve it using the key change function okay uh, key change uh, parameters like in roll up and all so get the unique values from the input data like we have an input like this code and country like code is first that is country and set the two uh, code number two is for cities uh, basically within the country okay for usa let's say in europe right for in uk in and london right london and two are city in the uk for wherever a uh, country is there there will be a code one wherever cities are there will will have a two as a so um uh, uh, without uh, key change fun function right we need to indicate to the role of function that when my key change is happening because they are repetitive right one two one two one two two right so this group is one this this is another group this is another group right to separate really uh, processing all these uh, groups right let's say we have these kind of inputs right and produce one record out of these you know right so we need to uh, indicate to the roll up or uh, the grouping uh, uh, process that our keys you know changed or not when what what is the place uh, you know, we are changing the key so the output requested is like uh, we will have a code like 222 and uh, these are the india india comma mumbai so comma separated you know outputs followed by country all the cities should be there like usa new york uk edinburgh and london so let's try to solve it actually basically we will use the roll up here uh, we will have uh, some temporary type okay l countries we will have uh, you know the the uh, uh, concatenated values right and count is to uh, track the counts okay so uh, let's assign this uh, count as zero for the first record and country as the n dot country right for a particular group so when my key is changing so what we need to see in the data and try to tell the roll up that my key uh, let's uh, change the key whenever this happens so whenever you know code is happening comes one right my next group starts you know so this time uh, code is one so my next group started until and unless again the new key uh, uh, code comes one new groups doesn't starts right similarly for here also if any other also comes like after two let's say we have some other country right so xyz country and then followed by this number of cities right so for example and then there will be a indication of the code so whenever so when the key change function returns the true is like whenever in one dot code is equal to one if so you know that key change function takes the two values in one and in two I know in previous and current, right? Or current and the next, right? So whenever the code is going to be one, right? Okay, for the I and one, the roll up should change the group. And for a particular group, so only trick is here. For a particular group processing, what we need to do is, if temp dot count not equal to zero. then string concatenate temp dot countries in dot country okay so right so it is saying that whenever the count is zero in the sense of for first record the countries is starting with the in dot country field otherwise what we need to do is uh we need to keep on appending so that we can produce this kind of output right so only when count is zero we don't have to do anything else we need to do the concatenation right 
so this is the roll up process and count we need to keep on increasing right likewise so this is the whole soul you know thing actually basically so in the finalize we just need to assign so nothing is over here major major thing is like you need to decide when to indicate to the roll up that my group has changed so that's when the our key change function comes into picture so thank you so much uh, please subscribe my channel and we are going to discuss many more things in my video particularly the scenario based questions and the uh, and the theoretical uh, uh, concept wise also we are going to check in the next videos thank you so much